This is one of the very high grade lots of gem silica. It's about 2,000 carats as well. But you can see this is all very hard, very translucent material. And if you're going to be making jewelry of the very highest caliber, this is the kind of material you're going to seek out. You're going to have things that are big enough that give you matched stones through the entire piece. It'll be big enough so that they won't be tiny. There's generally some irregularity to these, but they're not terribly bad. These are all over half inch up to almost an inch in thickness. There's some wedging as you can see in this one. And this piece has a lot of translucency compared to even this one, which is actually quite nice. So whenever you're looking for gem silica, getting one of these kind of lots is more desirable if you're going to make higher grade stones for a very discerning clientele. When you're inspecting particularly high grade lots, as this one is, it's about 2,000 carats, you want to know what does this look like really. There's a small bit of host rock on it. It is very thin, kind of a little piece that tapers out to almost nothing here. So that's the thickest part, the thinnest part. Let's see what they look like wet. These are all very, very bright blue. Interesting patterning with the black copper oxide tenorite. This one is very translucent. It's a lighter blue, but you can see how lively the edges are very quickly. Nice and solid. Lots of radial texture inside of the gem silica. This is nice stuff. So you'd be happy inspecting it this way so you know what it's going to look like. This is the patterning on the surface of the vein and it very quickly goes into the solid material.